Welcome everyone to the Mount Weekly Wrap-Up Show. This week we have numerous segments for you in our episode, including the recently held Mount Legacy Hockey Night along with the Spring Sports Liturgy. We also have highlights for you from recently played boys volleyball against Charaho High School along with boys lacrosse against Ponagansett High School and baseball action against Tiverton High School. Our first segment tonight takes a look at our boys and girls outdoor track team and their first meet at Smithfield High School. Here's to the highlights.
uh, and we intend to hold these legacy nights in the future on all sorts of topics related to the impact that this school has had on so many of its students. And what better legacy to begin with than our hockey legacy? And uh, this place is home. Uh, like I said, I grew up playing uh, for the North Stars. I wanted to play at Mount. I played with Brian since we were kids. We went to elementary school together. Peter's a little bit older uh, than us. It's a pretty simple story. And for me, Mount was all I knew. I mean, going to high school games with his father or my father. And, Watching Pete or, or other guys, the Brian Stimes, his older brother Bruce, playing for the soccer, uh, Villanova was playing against Mount. It was an exciting time growing up in Washington. Remember, I grew up with, you know, I know pretty much every single Mount player that there is. Uh, I know all the past, if you, and I know who's on the team now. I, I've just been in Mount hockey so much, uh, it, it, it's it's my problem. He wanted to play so bad, it was a lot of pressure for me just because I wanted to be them, you know, and I had to be them. And it was my father and my brother, and to accomplish that goal and uh, to actually win a state championship was probably the biggest relief of my life. Talk about legacy. Uh, when we talk about a legacy at Mount, I think we must start with one man who epitomizes the word. Coach Norman Bill Gulott. In our first home game against Hendrickin, one of our players hit the ball off the net and it, oh, another player on their team touched the ball and went flying out of bounds. A player, a player on our team dodged the ball out of bounds and the ref called it out. We, so, someone on our team started complaining and we, we held our composure and we respected the ref's call.
this concludes this week's episode. Next week we plan to have more season previews for you from our spring sports teams here at Mount St. Charles, along with our usual game highlights throughout our episode. Thank you for your time and have a good night.